Oh my god, it happened again. Again, oh my god. So, <clears throat> this is officially the fourth time I've been swatted. I, I cannot believe this. So, <clears throat> and by the way, this is scarier than, th th this was probably the most scariest one out of all three of them. And speaking of scary things, there's a gigantic spider there. Holy shit, look at that. With his leg up in the air. Luckily, I'm not scared of spiders, so that's good. But anyways. <sighs> I cannot believe this. So, I was upstairs in my room, messing around with the cat. Not sexually, of course. And... <clears throat> then, I happened to look at my bedroom window... And guess, and guess what I see outside? I see police lights. Or police sirens. Whatever you want to say. And <clears throat> then a cop comes to the loudspeaker and says, This is the Memphis Police Department. We have it completely surrounded. Come out with their hands in the air. Which is what I did. And of course they woke up my mom. So we went outside with our hands in the air because well, we did not want to get shot. And, um, and also, someone called in that I was making a bomb in the house, and that was gonna blow up part of the city, which, by the way, is complete and utter bullshit, obviously. And, which means that <clears throat> not only did, like, half of the Memphis Police Department get called in, and the SWAT team, but, guess what also got called in? The bomb squad, the bomb squad got called in. That's what that's what makes this one scary, scarier. And um, and I was so scared that I was shaking and that I had goosebumps all over me. That's how scared I was. So, uh, the police officers handcuff handcuffs me, both me and my mom, and um. Yeah, no, they, um, I guess interrogate us. Well, not interrogate us, and just ask us a bunch of questions while the bomb squad guys search the house to make sure there's no bomb, and they said that they didn't find anything. And, um, yeah, and, um, my mom told us, uh, told them, I mean, not told us, told them that it was a big mistake and that you guys got the wrong information or the wrong house. So... They, so they believed her, and, um, yeah, and they uncuffed us, and, yeah, we all went about our nights, and, well, my mom, she went dead, she, she went back to sleep, which, I don't know, I don't know how she managed to do that. I mean, I mean, this, 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 this literally happened 30 minutes ago. 30 minutes ago, and my mom's already dead asleep again. I really don't know how she did that after all the, after all that crap that just went down. Wow. <coughs> well, after that, I probably won't get that much sleep tonight. Wow. Now, like I said, I have been, that's the fourth time I've been swatted, but that one, that one was a whole lot serious and a whole lot more scarier than the past. Three times I've been swatted. Oh, it just never ends. It never ends. Like, I don't know why the hell these little immature little hackers think this crap is okay. It's not. It's messed up, okay? It's complete and utter horse shit what this is. It's, it, it's complete and utter bull. It's just a load of crap is what this is. It's a load of stupid ass bullshit. Seriously. And I'm really getting sick and tired of this swatting bullshit. I'm really getting, I'm really getting just so sick and tired of this shit. Seriously. With these little, like, with these little ten-year-old hackers. Just calling the entire fucking SWAT team. And, like, I just don't, I just don't get it. I just don't understand the minds of some people. Whoa. Okay, well, never mind. That... Spider is pretty scary. <laughs> I think it's actually laying a spider web out right now. That's cool. But anyways, I, I, 
it just never ends. The endless circle of nonsense, I guess. The endless circle of nonsense is what it feels like I'm stuck in. Always have been stuck in that and always will be, probably. Anyways, that's it. It's bullshit.